YouTube. I got uh, <clears throat> quite a few requests um, to cold start this again. Hi, Nani. To uh, cold start my helm light again because, uh, as you might have seen, I rebuilt the carb. Um, got it uh, tuned up. Got the stupid plastic tuning knobs on there. Has stupid plastic stops. Nani. And uh, they just want to see it uh, cold start again. Um, it ha it is 100% cold. There's your muffler, backside of the finger on it. It's just freezing. Here's the, the block. Here's the block head. My fingers on it. It's just cold. I haven't. The last time I started it was yesterday morning, and it has been sitting in this spot with the gas tank on the ground, and it is low on gas. I'm gonna go get more gas, because I found that, that when this thing gets low on gas, it's kind of a pig. So I'm gonna be, I'm gonna go get some more gas. Okay, got a can of gas now. There's a crap load of birds up in that tree, like usual. And I'll get her filled up here, not all the way, but fuller than it is. Ah, uh, ten bucks. Why is the glass gas purple? Probably what the the old oil in there or something. Ah, uh, there we go. Ah, uh, it's almost full. There we go. And just to prove to you that I didn't start this on the break, still cold. And the outtake, the exhaust comes out right here uh, out of the engine and goes this way. So this is usually the hottest pot. So, alrighty, cold starter now. Everything's working great. Primer up one more time. Here's a myth that I'm going to bust for you here. Two cycle bulbs, when you push them, don't work like you think they do. When you push them, they don't squirt gas into the block, like four cycles do. All it does is it brings the fuel in and squirts it back out. It just um, it purges the carburetor of air, which in turn helps it start. So we're going to start it up here. No throttle or anything. See, there's your first pull, and then the second pull, I need a little bit of throttle. Still cold. Sounds great. Look at the birds! Holy crap! Look at the crap little birds up in that tree. <laughs> well, that scare them. <laughs> this is what I do when I get bored. <laughs> Look at them all fly. 
What scared most of them out of my tree? Look at all of them though. I bet you they're eating that. That's what they're doing. They're eating that bad fruit. Well, that's fine with me. They're just going to clean the tree up. Cool. Free apple removers. <laughs> cool. They have loud, loud little buggers though. There's a whole crap load of them up in that tree way up there. There's a whole bunch in this apple tree right here and that apple tree over there. And that whole crap load of them up in that tree too. Holy moly, there's a bunch over there too. Holy moly. There's a crap little bird back here. Well, here's your cold star for you. Um, if you have any other cold star requests, just let me know. I'll get them done for you. I got a leaf blower, craftsman chainsaw, pro land chainsaw, which I need to get both of those back inside. Oh, let's see, what else can this cold start for y'all? Got my rideable lawnmower over there. I got the generator on my the generator on my um, motorhome. Let's see. Gotta unlock it here. No, that's not right. Got a padlock on my on my shed here. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Got that weed eater. It's a eager beaver. It's got a lot of power. Got that weed eater. MTD. It's just got uh, even more power than that one by far. Got my hom light. But with an engine built by Briggs and no, by John Deere. I have my lawn boy, which I could cold start for you. All the rest of the lawnmowers have been put away for the winter. Um, that back there I might be able to cold start. I'm not sure. And that back there is a weed eater. Not me. So if you want me to cold start anything else, just let me know. See you later. Look at them all. Look at them. Look. I don't even. I don't know what they are. They're pretty though. There's black and some of them have red chests. Cool. Huh. Garden truck full of junk. See you later, YouTube. Hope you enjoyed the cold start. Bye.